Welcome to Keep Smiling, the e-commerce customer experience podcast. Hello and welcome to another episode of Keep Smiling. I'm your host, Ty Walters, and as you may have noticed, it's been a while since we've published a new episode, uh, just about a year, and before that, it's been pretty sporadic, but I'm here to change that. And, And today, we're starting with a new format where I'm going to present a topic every week to you, and I'll cover more at the end. But not only that, the topic I cover will be in uh, one take. Uh, We're gonna set a timer, and and we're going to use that as a practice of regularly publishing and and making sure that we're getting succinct, concise updates out that will help customer service teams everywhere. So let's go ahead and start the clock and jump into it. The topics I'd like to discuss today are a reintroduction to Seller Smile and me, customer service, this podcast, our co-founder's next journey, and what's next. If you're listening to the audio, we are streaming a video of this, most likely available on YouTube, and I'm doing a simple screen share with a timer and some slides on my laptop. Uh, but let's start off with customer ser- uh, Seller Smile, rather. Seller Smile is the company that I co-founded with my partner, Roughly six to six and a half years ago, in 2017, our mission was to help Amazon sellers with their customer service, and that expanded shortly to omni-channel, things like Shopify and Amazon, uh, Shopify, Amazon, uh, reputation management, product reviews, seller feedback, off Amazon to Walmart and eBay and things like that, anywhere online sellers are offering their products. And we offer a range of services under the umbrella of customer service. And we have a range of clients selling a variety of different products. So we're always learning something new and the the field is constantly changing. Now, Seller Smile and this podcast is mainly about customer service. Customer service is a big term and we gain a lot of inspiration from Amazon's leadership principles. And their top one, and it's been the top for so long, is customer obsession. And it says, leaders start with the customer and work backwards. They work vigorously to earn and keep customers' trust. Although leaders pay attention to competitors, they obsess over customers. And this is the lens that we like to take in our service and with our clients, really focusing on the customer, being obsessed and meticulous about what's concerning them, what their feedback is, and how to make their experience better. Ultimately, this is the flywheel that drives any business, whether you're a SaaS, uh, physical products, brick and mortar. Your customers matter, their satisfaction, and their opinion of you and your brand. So we're obsessed, and we try to be continually obsessed about our customers at Seller Smile. So let's talk about this podcast. The title of the podcast is Keep Smiling, the e-commerce customer experience podcast. It's kind of a mouthful, and a couple of issues have arisen. There is a Keep Smiling podcast, and there's a e-commerce customer experience podcast. So the The ability to distinguish ourselves from the field has changed since we first started this podcast three years ago or so. So I think there's a name change uh, in the works, and we'll just continue to maybe talk about that on the podcast and figure out where that goes. But it's not going to be a a big one. I'm not going to make some some big a deal out of it. I know the content and the regularity that is more important. So, uh, but you know, welcome to keep smiling. This is on brand for seller smile. Smile, the, the service company, and it, it encapsulates our, our uh, idea and our goal to bring kind of like a happiness, lightheartedness to customer service when a lot of it can be you know, really difficult conversations. So moving along, we have uh, the topic of our co-founder's next journey. And, and uh, here we are recording in early 2024. In late 2023, my co-founder and I reached a decision and an agreement where um, I would purchase his interest and continue on running the company and he has moved on to a different career and this uh, this decision it took about a year to to from start to to end and a lot of time and energy went into it and for the most part it, you know it was a win win although it was um, quite difficult at, at many uh, in many uh, points along the way uh, but here we are with uh, kind of like a new journey in front of us uh, in terms of seller smile what we're about and um, who we're comprised of. But it's renewed my dedication to offer premium customer service to e-commerce brands and uh, more excited than ever to do that in this new year. There's so many interesting developments and uh, our 
our inability, so to speak, to publish regularly in the past. It wasn't uh, for lack of content and interesting ideas. So really happy to start sharing more of these ideas moving forward. What's next? As a podcast listener myself, I understand and realize regularity is important. I like to have consistency, and that's what we're going to deliver here. So weekly on Mondays, expect a new episode out, a different topic regarding customer service. E-commerce, online customer service is what we're covering mostly in this podcast. Of course, that's going to be tangent helpful to customer service and brick and mortar and SaaS and other tangent applications, healthcare. But this is mainly about selling products online and helping the customers that you're serving complete their purchases. What it takes to do that, what type of technical setups are required and, and, and what it's all about in this day and age. So five minute timer, one take, and that's it. Thanks and see you next episode.